Good afternoon, guys. You know this saying, as Ohio goes, so goes the nation. Well, we have more details on that here at your local election headquarters. Donald Trump Jr. is making a stop in the Miami Valley today. He's here campaigning for his dad's reelection. This comes after last night's fiery and often chaotic presidential debate. Two News reporter Devro Bogart joins us live in Tip City, where a crowd is already forming. Well, Lauren, it's a pretty windy, chilly uh, morning out here, and the doors don't even open until 1. However, people were already lining up at 1030. Now, his campaign team says today he will react to last night's event and continue to highlight the president's accomplishments here in Ohio. Now, today's rally is being held at Cedar Springs Pavilion in Tip City. This comes just a week after the president held a campaign rally in Vandalia. Attendees today were able to register for two tickets each, but first, First come first served. They had to agree to the risk of COVID-19 and similar to President Trump's rallies last week. Not many masks are being worn today. Now Trump Jr. is expected to begin speaking today at 2 p.m. And as I said, the doors will open at 1. We expect him to react to last night's debate after both candidates are being criticized for name calling and personal attacks. Now we will have a quick one on one interview with Trump Jr. immediately following this afternoon's rally and a CNN poll does say that debate watchers, uh, six out of 10 of them say that Biden won last night's debate. Of course, we will ask him about that and have the latest for you tonight right here on 2 News. Reporting live in Tip City, Deborah Bogart, 2 News, working for you.